Hello and thank you for tuning in. Today I'm gonna show you the settings I use on my Fuji X100F. And you may be wondering which color do you have on your Fuji X100F? I have the brown limited edition. It looks like this. And today I'm gonna show you my best street photography settings that I use on the Fuji X100F. So just so pick up your camera and we will go through the settings together. Maybe you have got the camera right now and wondering how should I set it so up. The first setting you can go and do is to set your shots to RAW plus JPEG. Fujifilm has some super cool film simulations that you can use when you are shooting in JPEG and when you are shooting in RAW you can edit the photos like you want to edit it. I love to edit my photos so I'm usually shooting in RAW. So go over and tap RAW plus JPEG. The film simulation on the Fuji X100F is super cool. They have so many variants you can use if you are shooting in JPEG. And my two favorites are with color, it is classic chrome. And if I'm shooting in black and white, I will say monochrome. You have all these features in your X100F and try them out and find your favorite. out in the streets and want to get those candle shots, I'm setting my camera to aperture priority. I don't want to miss any shots of having my camera on manual and I suddenly don't have time to adjust when the right moment is there, so I set it on aperture mode. So when you're gonna set your Fuji X100F on aperture priority, you set it on here, you put it on A mode and you adjust with this ring the aperture. Let's go over to the f-stop because this is something you adjust when you are on aperture priority. Aperture is set here with the ring and it controls how much light you get in here. So. You can define it if you're gonna have some blurry background or if you want a super sharp object and background. So I tend to set it on 4. 4 is the best for me when I'm shooting out in streets. A middle, I can get a little bit blurry in the background if I'm some feet behind. 
in the back and if I get close it's still sharp enough. So four is the aperture I'm using. super cool thing to have it on the top it's so easy to adjust when you are trying to take photos and you need to just yeah get it there you can flip it over and it's sitting the prime lens on the Fuji X100F that is fixed you cannot take it off it's super good it's a 23 millimeter and I don't like to get close up in the face to people because then you can mess it a little bit up 